I look young, I'm tired of looking young. My hair looks young like a baby. My face is like a baby. These braces, I can't wait to take them off because they remind me of when I was young. I just look like a baby. I feel like I gotta wear tight clothes just to show that I, I'm not a baby, that I'm really as old as I am. All right. Yeah, she does look young there. Let's take one more look at what she looked like before. Okay. Now let's meet the new, older, mature Lisa. Come on out. Oh, mm, that's my kind of girl. <laughs> You're looking fierce, girl. Thank you. Are you happy? Oh, I'm very happy. I'm tired. They just got rid of everything. Of, and I got my braces off next week, so that'll even help even more. That's yeah. great. Yeah. That is great. All right, Marie, what'd you do with her clothes? I love that jacket. Yes, her gripe was that she works as a receptionist and that people would come in and just bypass her thinking she was someone's daughter in the office for the day. She wanted the respect that she needed at work, and so we got her little career uh, suit that's still trendy and young, a fitted waist and all the um, suit tash detailing, and she's ready for the office, but still, she's young and trendy. It looks great. It looks great. I mean, I, a lot of people wouldn't complain about looking young. No, but, I mean, my sister's there, and every time we walk by, walk down the street and stuff, you know, we, everybody's like, oh, who's older? And then they point to my sister, oh, she's older, you look 14. And I'm like, no, you know? So you just want to be taken seriously yeah. and be just seen as more mature. Bit. Okay, mm -hmm. let's hear about her makeup. Great, Lisa's pretty much in the same category as Sharon. Uh, she's got beautiful eyes, um, and what we did was we really worked with natural colors like taupes and pale yellows and really defined her mouth with a natural color. It's a little bit more of a rust color. Uh, we didn't feel like she needed any type of blush or anything to bring out her cheeks. She's got beautiful Great cheek cheekbones. Bones. And uh, she's got almost a perfect nose. I mean, if anybody has a perfect nose, you know, it's, it's Lisa. So uh, she was really easy to work with, and um, I think she came out she looking great. She looks beautiful, yeah. And what about her hair, finally? All right, the first thing I have to say before we talk about her hair is how many people are scared about getting their hair cut short? Many, right? This is the girl in the Guinness Book of World Records. She is the most scared person. And all we did with her is bring her length up just a little bit, and she was so frightened. But if you just do a little bit of style change, and if you saw in the before, she had this big parting in the center, and it showed up her forehead. We covered up her forehead with some fringe, and we worked the hair toward her face, and she looks beautiful now. I we think evened it's out a dramatic the color. change. What do you think, audience? You like it?